Hi guys. <laughs> this is new. I've not done this in a month and I'm sorry for that. Hi guys. My name is Alyssa Marley and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am back. That is the key word of this video and I've been gone for a bit. I'm now going to be doing a spring favorites if we will. Um, I'm going to combine the past two months that I've been at MIA on this channel and just fill you in on some of the cool stuff that's happened. So my biggest news has been, I was in a podcast um, the past month. It actually just released the past two weeks, which was is great. Now I can link it to you. But I was a guest on the Film Flock podcast, which is a branch of the Blackbird Film Festival, which I was a part of in my college experience. I was... Um, a part of that internship from 2017 to 2018 and I've lived in the area since and have always um, volunteered so they did like a little spot on me um, at my job and then they also did a spot on me doing this my YouTube experience that I can't even believe because it really has been a small hobby of mine so that has been a really really cool thing I will link those two videos there's a two-part series I will link those down below. And speaking of podcasts, I guess we could branch into another thing I did last month was I read a book. I finally been back on the reading horse. I really have been slacking with my uh, my Kindle and I read an actual tangible book. This one is called Radio Silence by Alice Oseman. And I was recommended this by a YouTuber on here, Paperback Dreams, I believe her name is. And it was really, really good. And speaking of a podcast, it follows high school students um you know podcasting type of all that stuff high school drama just all that jazz I really don't want to give much away but this book very very good definitely recommend the next category I think we can go into would be jewelry let's go there so my favorite piece has been actually this piece I'm wearing and it says my birth year which is 1996 I got this off of Etsy really affordable and very very cute I take it off when I shower but other than that it's been great I've been working out a lot lately so it works um, in between those it's definitely a very appropriate length it is an 18 inch chain and I think it lays really really well where you don't um, you see it even if you're wearing a t-shirt this shirt is a bit longer but I've been loving it along with um, earrings I've been really into dangly and or hoops uh, these are my new favorite, I don't really know how to show them without putting them on, which I probably should, but um, these have been really fun to wear. In addition, these are also my mom's, these little hoop danglies. So these have been really fun to wear. Uh, so the next category, I guess, will go into food. Lately, I've been loving to make pickled red onions. My favorite um, like dining out place has been Core Life Eatery. And they've always had like pickled red onions when I always get them in like a salad or even like a bowl, like a rice bowl. And I've been loving them, but it's such an easy, easy recipe. I cut up as much as I really want. I guess say half an onion, depending on how big your onion is. You do a cup of, you do equal parts water and vinegar. And then you do, you know, a tablespoon of salt and sugar. And you mix that up. You put it outside um, your refrigerator for about like an hour. And then you can put it in after. And they're probably pickled within three hours, but I don't use them until like the days after, but they're so, 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 so good. Um, another thing I've been loving to make has been homemade salad dressing. I use a Dijon mustard, some olive oil, apple cider vinegar, and then I do some like lemon juice. Uh, you don't have to do that as well, but I've been loving that with, you know, salad and then the pickled onions, as mentioned, that has been a, a staple lunch um, the past few days and weeks. Um, another snack idea has been sweet and savory. So my savory snack would be the TikTok favorite peppers, cream cheese, and everything but the bagel. That has been so, so, so good. And then my sweet snack has been baked oats. And you can make this in a variety of like a dish or rather a cupcake tin. And you just kind of ground up oats and or you don't have to ground them up. But you just kind of make the oatmeal. But instead of putting, putting it in the microwave, you put it in the oven the next favorite has been painting my Adirondack chair. I painted it this past Easter and it was actually quite an, quite an experience. I didn't know how it was going to go, how long it was going to take, but it took me three hours to paint one chair and it was 
definitely like pretty long but it was so 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 worth it it looks so pretty it's a nice blue bright blue color we got the paint from Lowe's and I overall just love that thing love sitting in it it's been great well that wraps up my spring favorites I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you in the next one bye mm -hmm.